guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Christine Lee, in case you're new here, and I'm so excited because I'm actually starting a new series where I'm essentially going to be making a bunch of videos for back to school. And so today I'm going to be starting, as I'm sure you could tell by the title, with a video about some school supplies and my backpack and what's uh, going to be in my backpack when I take it with me to college. So again, if you're new here, I am going to be a rising freshman at Harvard University this fall. Um, I leave in actually a few weeks, three to four weeks, and I'm very nervous but really excited too. So I've been slowly gathering all the things that I need for this upcoming school year, dorm supplies, um, school supplies again, and I am so excited to share all that with you. So I'm going to start off by showing you guys my backpack and what I'm hoping to uh, take with me uh, in it. I'm not exactly sure if these are the supplies that I'll need or will end up actually using because again, I've never actually been to college before. I'm a freshman or gonna be a freshman. So I think I have some really cool things to get me started uh, with this new year. Started off right. So just to show you guys, I have everything in here. So it's kind of heavy right now, but this is my backpack. It's very, I honestly like the style of it. It's pretty minimalistic. So there's this felt part right here. So I have a bunch of really cool buttons, feminist buttons. We got, of course, Notorious RBG. Um, this is actually made by a friend. Her name's Caitlin. It was really, really cute. And then this is a Parkland, Parkland pin that I got when I went for the, uh, to the March for Our Lives. So just to give you a little tour of my backpack, I have this front pocket right here zipped um and then i have two main pockets and then two side pockets and i think i got this from nordstrom i think i think nordstrom rack um but it was really cheap i think i got it for like 18 dollars. it was on sale and when i saw it and i saw that the, it was on sale i just couldn't say no so i'm really really happy with it so this is what it looks like on the inside there is like a laptop pocket here right here um and it's really heavy right now because i have like everything in here obviously i'm not going to be taking all this in my backpack all at once all the time but i guess just to fit everything in at once i wanted to show you guys so here we go so first for my laptop this is the laptop case this is actually my sister's but she ended up not using it ever so she gave it to me um so i really love the color um it's kind of like a it feels almost like denim there's a mini pocket right here so i can keep like my flash drives and stuff like that and this is my laptop it's a dell xps 139370, I think, yeah. Um, I love it so much. It's touch screen. So this is what it looks like right here. And these are my stickers on it. I started adding some stickers already. Um, so again, just some cool stuff to personalize it a little bit. I'm probably gonna use this a lot for college for sure. Taking notes and everything like that. And of course, editing videos. Then we have my book stand case. And if you watch my study with me video, you've probably already seen this. I got this from Amazon. I love it so much. I honestly put my laptop on it too. Um, if you put it on the lowest setting, then it's almost just like a little ramp and it's raised like that much. I put my laptop here. Um, but also I use it for my textbooks and stuff when I'm studying. So this is really handy, especially when I'm uh, planning on going to the library and having a really long study session, then I know I can bring this with me and it'll be well used. Then we have my laptop charger, pretty simple. Here's my pencil case. I actually don't know where I got this from. Maybe from like a Korean bookstore. I mean, it was my sister's and again, this was completely new. She ended up not using it ever, so she gave it to me. Some two more pins. Again, this is also made by my friend Caitlin, feminist pin. And then for the supplies that I'm using, I have a small pack of tissues already kind of used. Eraser, whiteout. I always need whiteout. <laughs> I make so many mistakes all the time. Really simple, cheap, big pen. But then my favorite pens are my uh, Muji pens. Haha, <laughs> of course, I'm pretty basic. Um, I have a bunch of like colored ones. These are definitely not the only ones that I have, but this is just like what I've been using lately. And then I also have pretty simple mechanical pencil and a sharpener. This is an up and up sharpener. So all my school supplies are really basic. I usually always get my school supplies from Target and stuff, but my pens are generally Muji. Then we have this amazing pack of mild liners. There are so many beautiful colors. I literally am obsessed. I'm so happy that I got this because I was running out of my old pack. Um, it was the small basic, like I think five color pack. And I've had that for literally like two years. Um, so I saw this at Target and I picked it up. I'm really excited. I'm gonna use this a lot for when I'm taking notes because I like taking pretty notes. 
So yeah, this is from Target. And then this is my bullet journal. Um, yeah, it's a simple bullet journal. It's that one where it has like a really hard name to pronounce. Luke, Luke, term, look term. And I don't know. I love it. It has the dotted grid note, uh, paper, dotted grid paper. So I love this. I use it all the time for when I'm just keeping track of what I have to do. Then we have my Muji notebooks. Um, so I got this actually, I forget, I was in the city once or somewhere. I got this pack of Muji notebooks and they're so, so cute and very convenient to have. This is like the right size for what I want when I take notes in class. It was a pack of uh, five and was on sale and they all have like different colors on the spine. So very simple, um, basic and I feel like it'll really come in handy. And then I have these notebooks left over. I think these are also Muji. I can't really tell. Moleskin, sorry, these are Moleskin notebooks. And this came in a pack of three to six? I don't know, but I ended up taking uh, three of them. I think I split it with my sister. We got this from Costco and uh, I had a black one along with these two, but I already used the black one for physics notes uh, during senior year. And so this is just what they look like on the inside again. Pretty basic, so I really like the simple basic notebooks where I know that I can just uh, use them really easily for casual notes or for like actual pretty note taking. Um, and the fact that they're thin means that it'll be really easy to just take them anywhere on campus. So now going into the second compartment slash pocket, I have a pack of reusable metal straws. Um, that I really want to make a good habit of taking around with me when I'm in Massachusetts Then also a random like reusable tote bag kind of thing. So I just have that my wallet random uh, Tape roll and also some post-it notes. Then I have my phone charger. And this is a really cool staple stapler that my sister got for me from Muji and then my graphing calculator and then I have my airpods um, I actually didn't have this until a few weeks ago. My uncle got it for me as a graduation gift. So I actually use this a lot for when I'm studying and stuff. So I guess I have now hopped on the uh, AirPod bandwagon. It's actually really good. And then that's pretty much it for my backpack. So I'm very happy with all the items that I have for my school supplies, for my backpack. I do feel a little bit more prepared knowing that they have that part of the college prep process done. I am still working on getting like the last bits and pieces for my dorm room. So once I have all that done, I'll be able to do a haul for you guys. And I do have some other really cool little videos planned for my back to school series. So please be sure to stick around for that. Otherwise, um, I guess I'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>